Yes, I was very excited to come to this program. It, it felt like this was the right thing for me at the right time. My excitement didn't stop when I came here. However, it's been a very overwhelming experience. Uh, you know, I didn't, I didn't really understand the extent of work that was waiting for me here. Not that it, it's too much, but it's a lot of thinking and thought processing, uh, and it's a, new, it's a new environment. You have to adapt to the environment. What I expected before I come was not like this. I have found it a lot better. Things were beyond my expectation. I came along with my own um, strats I'd been working on back home. So whilst here, my focus immediately is to isolate and characterize some novel compounds from these extracts, which will go a long way to help me in terms of my completion of my PhD program. It's really opening my eyes to what kind of things I could do and I want to do to have these uh, consequent, a, a direct and real consequence to the people that can benefit from our discoveries. For me, professional development is what I'm going to get from this program. I'm going to get exposed to Novartis Labs and the technology that they have available, um, which will help me back home setting up labs. For Novartis, for them it's an investment, it's an investment in the future. Investing in developing countries in, in Africa is pretty important because there's a lot that has to happen over there. This whole program that Colin and team started is so innovative and the idea here is that five, ten years down the line when we have two, three thousand Novartis interns you will be contributing to innovative ideas. We don't mind whether it's with a competitor company uh, or it's with, preferably it's with Novartis, as long as you're solving problems for your own community and country and driving research and development. The most interesting thing for me in this internship is the technology that I'm using. So I'm using next generation sequencing which we do not have. And the genetics of non-communicable diseases, it's quite important because it gives a lot more information. Here, we can create a network with other participants in, on the, in other places of the world, from Brazil, from South Africa, from Tanzania, from China. And I think I like it very much. Even though we are so different, but when we work together, the different don't become something to create a big conflict between us. On the contrary, the different help us to enhance the performance. And that is very interesting. It is worth to do the, uh, the internship program, especially if you've got uh, a, a better insight within yourself um, if you want to go back and help people and um, implement um, what you have learned from Novartis, it is a program that I would say um, it's worth to be spread all over the countries of the I mean, African region. So we all know that we need more medicines and vaccines in the emerging countries. We all know that we need more education campaigns. We all know that we need more uh, healthcare workers and researchers. But even if we fixed all of that, there's still one fundamental problem that exists. We don't know how our medicines really work in these countries. And basically because we haven't studied them from the ground up. And that's what the next generation scientist has as its core the ability to get researchers that go back and work on these problems on, from the ground up in the places where the diseases exist. Being in the Next Generation Scientist program is the best thing that could happen to you. It will change the way you do research and how you communicate your research. It's awesome. <laughs>